Hi everyone! In this video will demonstrate how to set up an APA style paper in Google Docs. There are some slight differences between Microsoft Office or Microsoft Word and Google Docs, so that's why I've chosen to record two videos to demonstrate this process. You'll see that the font for Google Docs is automatically set at Arial 11. We need to go ahead and change that to Times New Roman and size 12. The next thing that we need to do is to make sure that our paper is double spaced. So we choose line spacing over here and click double. The first thing that we need to do is to set up our header for this paper. We can access the header by double clicking at the top of the page. Unfortunately, every time that we double click up there, it changes our font, so we have to go ahead and change it again. Now we're ready to type our header. The first thing that you want to do is select this box that says different first page header footer because there is a slight difference between the cover page of your paper and the rest of the pages of your paper. And unfortunately, again, we have to change our font. The first thing that we need to do is type the words running head and follow that by a colon. Then we're going to turn the caps lock on and you're going to type a shortened version of your title in all capital letters. We can turn the caps lock off now and we're going to go ahead and insert our page number. And the easiest way to do this is to go ahead and click insert and come down to page number and select this first box. What we need to do then is hit the left arrow key and bring your cursor in front of that number and hit the tab key until it is over on the right hand side of the page as such. Alright, we can go ahead and close our header for now so we can do that by just double clicking in the middle of the page. So now we're back uh, to the rest of the page and we need to center and then we're going to hit the enter key about five times. That brings us down to the middle of the page and the first thing that you're going to type is your title of your essay. Then you're going to put your name and finally Richmond Community College. Now this is the bare minimum that you need for APA style. You may have other instructors who ask for additional information such as your course number or your section number but this is all I require from you. We're going to go ahead and keep hitting enter until we get to the second page. Now you'll notice our page number has followed us but the rest of our header has not and that's because we chose that different first page uh, for the top page. So we're going to double click and open our header again and we need to come over to the left hand side that number is going to come with us for now and turn the caps lock on again and type just your shortened title in all capital letters. Uh, we don't need the phrase running head this time and then hit the tab key until that two goes back over to the right hand side like so. Finally we need to close our header footer and then add our title in the middle of the page. Oh, sorry, take the caps lock off and then hit enter. Come back over to the left hand side and you're ready to start typing your paper.